We are gonna paint over this strange thing that happened that I don't really care for. Uh, we'll start with a black background and we're gonna do a neutral color scheme. I am being messy and flinging paint into my cups of paint that are already prepared. Okay. So we're going to do a simple swipe in some neutrals. Slightly different combination than the neutral color scheme that I tend to lean on. I'm going to limit it to black and white and gold and brown and see what we think. <clears throat> so, here we go. Gonna do a stripe of white. And a stripe of brown. and a stripe of gold. And a stripe do black so I'm aware that my canvas is really off level and I know that makes a lot of you guys nervous it makes me a little nervous but we're just gonna work quick if you've been watching me for a while you know I'm not a very careful painter um, so we're just gonna see how it goes I'm a student of Bob Ross, and I believe that accidents can be happy ones. Consciously swipe slower this time than I normally do. I like this variation right now. I know that that's because I swiped that area twice accidentally because of the overlap, but maybe it'll work out for the best. I'm gonna let it settle for a second. Move some things out of my way. Probably should hit it with the heat gun.
So I am trying to give it time to settle before I make any decisions. I like it. Um, and I like this color combination. It's got a nice softness to it um, and a warmth that some of my other neutral color schemes did not have in them, which I'm digging. I'm regretting the white though. I don't really like where the white is popping out, but maybe as this darkens that will be helpful that the white shows up in some places. I think I might tilt it back that way. digging these overstretched cells lately, aren't I? I'm scared to stretch it too much. I think I'm happy with it. We're going to stop. Again, there's no silicone in my recipe. I simply do the heat gun treatment to pop any air bubbles. I store my paint in bottles and shake it up to mix it so it tends to have air bubbles at first be just because of the way I store it and the way I mix it. Okay, we'll come back and check this out after it has dried. Hopefully it'll stay put. think in the comments like and subscribe click the bell icon in order to get more notifications and don't forget to check out my paintings and my merch like this shirt on seaholesharp.com bye and don't forget to follow me on instagram did you know i have an instagram i do i update it daily lots of new posts on what i'm working on new ideas and my most current projects you can keep track of what i'm up to on there so go and follow me check it out <laughs>